hey thanks for joining me today we are in the next video of my handful of videos on vitamin supplements for your mental and emotional health so today is vitamin K stick with me and I'll share with you what K stands for and why you need it in your life Right, vitamin K what could that be could be a lot of things but I have down that vitamin K is for kindness and I know that sounds like a little bit cheesy like oh my gosh did you get that off of Pinterest no I didn't it came from my own brain but I have it on here because it's necessary right I think um, if you've watched my other one on vitamin C it might connect to that a little bit if you haven't watched it go check it out I'll have it linked below um, but vitamin K for kindness, we need this supplement in our mental and emotional life because being kind to others actually does a lot for us as well. Obviously, you need to do that in a genuine state. If you're being kind just to like benefit yourself, then it's like really counterproductive and doesn't actually work. But there is um, another video I will link below. It's called A Very Happy Brain. I'm just sharing this with you because I think it's a good video. And it's like this cute little animation to explain the science really of what goes on on our brain. And um, it ultimately shares that compassion and gratitude is how we get to um, a, a happy place in our brain. And I am throwing kindness in with that mix because I think you have to be genuinely kind to be compassionate towards other people and to be grateful for what you have in your life or grateful for what other people do for you or something like that. And it's just a necessary supplement, if you will, to having an emotional healthy life or a healthy place. Um, kindness is focused on others and not so focused on yourself. And I think the society that we live in today is hyper focused on self and there's a lot out there about helping yourself and being your best self and doing what's good for yourself and I understand some of that thought process but when there's so much laser focus on the self you're obviously not looking out towards others and for others and honestly getting to a place that might be one of two things, which is self-destructive because you really don't like the self that you see and you're working so hard to love that self and it's kind of getting in this weird like uh, hamster wheel of I'm trying to love myself that I really hate and it's not working, right? Or the other side of um, just becoming a little bit self-absorbed with all of the self-love. Don't get me wrong, I think you should be confident in yourself. I think you should treat yourself with respect. The choices that you should make in your life should respect yourself and your body and your habits and all of those things. I'm all for that, but there is a healthy balance, right, of being good to yourself and being kind to yourself and being a healthy person. And being kind in a genuine sense to other people, I think, is a huge part of being good with yourself too. But the vitamin K, the kindness that we need as a supplement in our life for emotional and mental health is because it is faced outward towards others. It's because it's for other people, not for ourselves. And I think when you know a person that is just genuinely kind, you can feel it and it's coming from a very real place. And those are the kind of people that you just like to be around, you know? Kids are the best judge of this. Um, usually they are really, really intuitive and good at just kind of reading how a person is and who they want to be around and who they're easily drawn to and that sort of thing. And often they're drawn to the kindest, most giving, genuine, out hearted, meaning like they pour their heart out to other people. They're drawn to those types of people. So you need some vitamin K in your life. Thanks for listening. Follow along with the other vitamin supplements that I have coming up and hit all the buttons and share with a friend. See you next time.